Cheers for coming here. Um, before, I, before I start, uh, most of you know me. My name is Ellen, and um, I was... I was, um, I, was, um, I was out cycling with Jessica yesterday afternoon, and um, one of the things that I was really stressing about was that, you know, everybody yesterday had, you know, funny Parker, really knowledgeable about all the, um, you know, all your subjects, and you were so entertaining, and I just feel like, oh, this is such a, this is such a dry presentation, so I'm going to, you know, just, just have fun. But it's all, I just have, I just have. Um, but it's just, um, what I'm going to do today is give you the nuts and bolts of cricket, and we're going to talk, um, I'm going to talk a little bit about the history, how to play the game. Uh, we'll actually get to play a game, and, um, and then we'll talk about modifications. What are you going to do, how, do you, how you can use this game um, and modify it, or if you don't have the proper equipment. Uh, but anyway, the reason I'm doing this is also, I am not a cricket expert. But every year I like to introduce a new um, subject to my units because, frankly, I get bored of the same subjects every year. And so I'm always looking for something else. Um, so this year I decided to do cricket. I haven't done it. So um, in the last few weeks I became um, a semi-expert. So. Yes. so I'm going to try to really explain it as best I can as I understand it. Um, I live in the South Bay. The demographics in my South Bay have changed considerably in the last generation. And there are cricket leagues and cricket kids. They're playing in the neighborhoods. They're playing on weekends. It's almost taken over the soccer fields. I don't know whether, what it's like up here, but it is extremely popular um, in the San Jose area, Cupertino area. Do you see it in Cupertino? Do you see it? A little bit. Oh, I see it all over the place. A um, little history of the game. There's evidence that it was played in the 1400s in the southeast portion of England in Sussex and Kent. Um, it was mostly played by kids, and by the 1700s, the adults picked it up and introduced it to the rest of the world. The cricket, what, what is cricket? What does the word cricket have to do with this game? It's not cricket like the insect. It is um, cricket like Old English, C-R-Y-C-C. I don't really know how it's pronounced, but something probably similar to cric cricket. Is that how? C-R-Y-C-C. -C -C. Um, and that's why, that's why it's called cricket. Thank you, thank you. I have it right here. It means crutch or staff. So use probably using the stick was you know, similar to crutch or staff. So. Um, why I'm dressed like this is your traditional whites. If you're um, playing cricket um, in a professional league, you might have different colors. But traditionally, it's white. And you would wear, the umpires would wear a brimmed hat like this to keep the sun up. Um, many of the players you're going to see have red stains on their white um, pants, and that's from rubbing the ball. We'll talk about the equipment in a second. Um, it is this, believe it or not, this is the second most popular played game in the world. I didn't realize that. Behind soccer. Well, uh, but yeah, all, all the continents. Um, of, the, um, of the 196 countries in the world, 120 of them have court, uh, you know, organized leagues of cricket, which com completely blew me away. Um, the games, as you probably know, last anywhere from a few hours to days, 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 days. Yes, they do. They stop for tea, really. They stop for tea. We would stop and drink beers. They drink tea. Um, and then they would come back and play again, you know, the next day. Yes, it's played in the U.S. We don't have professional teams, but we play. come to Cupertino. You know, come watch it. Come to my school. I'm going to we'll play it down there. So the object of the game is very similar to baseball. Two teams of 11 players each. The batting team is trying to score, obviously, more runs than the fielding team. They're trying to defend or stop um, the number of runs. Um, each team is allowed to have, you can score, but when 10 batters have been dismissed, or what we would call out, or the designated number of overs, which is Pitches, we call pitches in cricket, it's called bowling. So if you've reached either 10 batters who are dismissed, or if you've reached the uh, designated number of bowls, the series of bowls or pitches are six, they are called overs. So every six balls that are pitched or bowled, that's one over. Uh, when you've met that designated number of overs, that, field, that batting team is dismissed, and the fielding team picks up the bat, and they start to play. Um, the field is, uh, is huge, about the length of a football field, about 60 yards across. In the middle of the field is a pitch. It's about uh, 60 yards the length. We're going to use this as our pitch today. And inside the pitch is um, 
three different creases or lines. The first crease is called the bowling crease. This is where the wicket stands. The wicket is made up of three stumps and a bale. Um, the line four feet in front of the bowling crease is called the popping crease. And this is um, really what designates where you have to run to score. We'll talk about scoring in a second. Um, so between here and here is a lot of action happens here. Unlike baseball, uh, unlike baseball, these batters don't bat this way. They bat. Um, excuse me for a second. They hold the bat down the ground. Down. No foul balls. No foul balls in this game. Uh, the ball is five and a half ounces. It's um, cork with a leather, leather cover. If anybody wants to see it. Okay. All right. So we've got two wickets. We have. We've got two wickets um, on the pitch. And here are the general rules. The offensive team, there are 11 on a team. The first two, I'm, I'm going to have people demonstrate. So, Mr. Parker, come on up. Um, do you want to be a striker or the batter, or do you want to be the non-batter? Uh, the batter. Okay. You're going to pick up. How do the wickets work? I'm going to tell you. I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to explain. Uh, we're going to go over it. So. On the, um, on the offensive team, on the batting team, two batsmen come up. Each of them have a bat in their hand. So Jeremy's going to take a bat, and he is going to. And the way this works is the bowler. I'm gonna, I need a bowler who's like a pitching yeah. person. Oh, oh, I don't want that ball. <laughs> um, I'm going to use a tennis ball today because of the wind. All right, so. Uh, Actually, Claire, Davis is batting. <clears throat> so, the object of the game, the bowler or the pitcher is going to stand at the opposite, behind the opposite wicket or opposite bowling crease, the line where the wicket's on. You don't do anything quite yet. Each of these batsmen are going to hold a bat, but the striker is the only one who's going to try to hit the ball. When the bowler is ready, in this game, you cannot bowl or pitch with a bent arm. You have to do a straight arm delivery. She is going to run up, not yet, to the popping crease, which is the first line four feet in front of the wicket. And she is going to deliver the ball. She's going to try to have it bounce once before Dave is going to hit it. Dave is going to stand with in front of the wicket in front of it, but do not touch the wicket. And okay, we'll talk about that in a second, too. So the object is, so Claire is going to bowl it, not quite yet, by running up to the popping crease, delivering the ball in an overhand, straight arm delivery, bouncing once. Dave is going to try to hit it. Again, he can hit it in, other, in any direction. He can hit it anyway. Once he hits it, Jeremy and Dave both keep their bats with them, different than baseball. And they run to opposite wickets. If they get over the popping crease with their body or touch it with their, uh, sorry, with their bat, you get one point. If you think you can keep getting points, keep exchanging positions on the field, on the wicket. Run, either step or place the bat, run back and forth. Okay? Yeah. So they're on the same team? They're on the same team. And then do they get two points for both cars? One point for every time they cross and make it over their popping crease. Okay. Um, now, I need another position who's a wicket keeper. This would be a defensive position, so you're going to be on Claire's team. You are like the catcher. You're going to stand behind the wicket. And your job would be to stop the ball that's coming if he misses it. You can also get um, the runners out. Okay, back to, back to offense. If Dave hits a ball and it goes over the boundary on a fly, it's automatic six points. And he doesn't have to run. If Dave hits the ball, it's a grounder, and a, and a fielder cannot
not stop it before it goes outside the boundary, it's an automatic four points. And he doesn't have to run. They don't have to run. Automatic. And he's still in the game. Unlike baseball, he can hit again because he's not out. Remember, in order to get a batter out, or in, in order for a batter to leave the field, they have to be put out. We'll talk about that, too. Okay? So the wicket keeper's job is just like a catcher. You're going to stop the ball. If Dave happens to be outside this crease area, when you have the ball, you can get him out by either knocking over the wicket or touching it with the ball. Oh. Now let's, so, let's talk about how, how, how runners can get out. A any questions so far? It's a lot of information. Any questions? <laughs> Goodwill. 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 Okay. You know what, if they hit it, when would they run? If they feel, if Dave hits it, oh, and not, that good question. If he hits it, and it's just going to be like a little yeah. ding shot here, they can choose not to run at all. They can say, oh, we'll probably get out on this. We're going to stay there. And then the bowler delivers another pitch or another bowl. Um, when they, if he thinks he's going to run, they're both going to run when they decide, oh, this is a good ball. We, we can get at least one... Um, one run. And they're going to talk to each other. They're going to communicate. Jerry's going to say, Jeremy might say, you know, run. Maybe, maybe Dave hit it backwards. He's not looking backwards. He's looking forward. But Jeremy can see that the wicked player, um, I mean, see, see, the wicked keeper's got the ball. He's going to say, you know, don't run. All right. On to outs. There's many ways to get out. Here's one of them. If Dave inadvertently hits the wicket with his bat, he is automatically out. He goes to his bench, and the next batter comes up. He's gone. Jeremy still stays in. If Dave hits a ball on a fly, and a fielder, there are a lot of fielders out here, catch it just like a pop-up, he's out. He's dismissed. He goes out. Jeremy stays in. If the wicket keeper catches the ball or gets the ball outside on a, on a, on a ball that is passed over this line, he missed it. By the way, there's no strike zone. It's just anywhere in this area. Wow. If, um, if he misses it, you catch it. He's out of the pop increase or the bowl increase. You can touch the wicket with the ball. He's out. He's dismissed. If Dave stands in front of the wicket, go ahead, stand in front of the wicket, and the ball is bowled to him, and Dave puts his leg out in front of the wicket to protect the wicket from getting hit or knocked over, because the object is, to, the fielding team is trying to knock over the wicket or touch it with the ball. If Dave puts his leg out to block the ball from a ball that was sure to hit the wicket, the umpire can call what is what? Uh, yep. Two more ways to get out. If the bowler, the bowler throws or delivers the ball, he misses it. Dave completely misses it, and that ball hits the wicket. He's out. He's gone. Lastly, if he's run out, if either one of these guys are run out, so Dave hits the ball, they exchange wickets, they run uh, across the pitch, they get to the other pop increase, but a fielder gets the ball and hits it or knocks over the wicket with the ball before either the runner gets to the pop increase, the runner closest to this wicket that was hit is out. He does it dismiss, the next batter comes in. Any questions so far? <laughs> <laughs> All right, I need, let's, let's play. Excuse me? You're out. You're out. You're out. You're out. OK, I need some fielders. fielders. You're just you know, spread out here. So you're just, um, you can leave. I'll take that ball. We're going to use the tennis ball. Are you gonna you're gonna bowl? Will you bowl? Okay. Um, and then will some of you will some of you be batters? Doesn't matter. It, oh, well, eleven, but I don't need that for the demonstration. No. Yeah. Give me like back here.
Like over here, Claire? Corner? Yeah. We need somebody up there. Let me go. Look at it like the whole circle. So we Okay. So we gotta hit that thing over when he's You can throw it to a fielder. Or just catch Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 No better, no better, no better. Throw it right to it. You're trying to get, you're trying to hit the wicket. All right, let's go. You don't want that on this. It's just three feet. All right. You have to run, too. I'll show you. Back that. Back it. Okay, that's a four. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That's a four. But that's a four. It's clear. That's a four. Okay, now, he's, he's still in. And you just scored four points. Go. He's still in. Oh. But that would, clear. that would be a bye with a score, the one run. Yep, yep. Okay, hit it on two. Yeah, good. No. Hit the wicket. Out. Okay, great. Okay, give it to give it to the next batter. So one, gotta get ten outs. To the wicket keeper, yeah. No. Okay, good question. The, 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 the question was, how come Jeremy is not hitting now? Jeremy's still the non bat he might never bat, frankly. After and over, which is six pitches, we switch. We switch positions that the ball is thrown to. No, no. If you don't think you can make it back, if you're only one point there, two points here. If you could think you can make it back, yeah. If, you, if you switch it on one, look, good question. If, if you get one run on odds, three, five, you would switch. Okay. Oh, get him out. Get him out. You can get him out. He's out of the popping crease. He's out of the popping crease. Sorry. Okay. You can hit not Go, you're still in. You are still in. You're not out. You keep going. Okay, now, Claire, Claire, that's that's six overs. Six, okay, so he's she's already done six pitches, which is a full over. Every time there's an over, a new a new bowler comes in. And you pitch from a different wicket. So now Jeremy's going to get to pitch, and we need a different, um, no, six. Six, yep, six, yep. Um, we need somebody to be a wicket keeper down here. You get back by, if, if, he, if the bowler hits the wicket, you're out. And it hits the wicket while he's standing there. He's out. If he hits, if that batter hits the wicket, then they're out. Yeah, just, yeah, Wally was getting cheap. Where's the bowler? Yeah. Straight. Not. No, they don't. No, they're, they're not Americans. 
say. They know better. Yes. You can talk. You can talk. As a matter of fact, in between every pit bowl, you can come, you can have a little meeting. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if they do that. I encourage them. Okay, that'd be one point. Oh no, that wasn't a pitch. Never mind. Coming from here. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Next batter, come in. Next batter, jump us out. No, one bounce or not. Stay ready. Maximum one. Oh, six. Six, six, six. Second base. You don't have to, Tommy. Tommy, you don't have to run even on a six. Spin it. No, 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 no. Get the wicket. Oh, 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 oh. Jessica's out. Nope. Yeah, yeah. Jessica's out. She was closest to that wicket. Huh? Who's just asking? You can 
considered a wide ball, a wide bowl, and that's an automatic one point for the batting team. Right. Wow. <laughs> Those are called extras. Go, go, oh. go, go, keep going, keep going. He's in, no, he's in, he's in, he's in, that's good. Um, any of the defenders want to hit? Switch with somebody, switch with Jessica or somebody if you want. All right, um, all right. <laughs> oh, yeah! Six, six, automatic six. Nice. Okay, now we switch. Switch the uh, bowling from this. Who has not bowled that wants to bowl? You still have to 
to touch the oh, you're getting into the middle. This one here. Um, what time does this...